guys, it's Nick here from the Golden Cooper, and today we are playing some Don't Starve. And yeah, we're not playing Minecraft. You guys don't know what Don't Starve is. This is going to be a tutorial. I'm going to show you everything that I know. I'm not a master yet. I don't know that much, but I know the basics that you need to know if you've never played the game before. So I, I know a good amount. So anyway, let's get right into this video. So first thing when you press play is you get to pick your character. So there's Wilson. He's just your normal guy he is he grows a magnificent beard which actually keeps you a bit warm and is nice then there's the fire starter named willow she likes to start fires and but she lights fires when nervous and she can like burn down a whole forest mm, well, that can be okay and that's okay then there's wolfgang he gets stronger with the full belly but you need a lot more to feed him and he is afraid of the darkness and monsters so it's not so good either then there's Wendy, um, she's haunted by her twin sister, she's okay with darkness, which is good, she doesn't hit very hard, and yeah, I think spawning her twin sister is really, mm, it's good, but there's some downsides that I'll get into later, maybe, WXMD8, I like this guy, he's my, he's my favorite, but I'm just gonna go with Wilson for this one, because he's a standard, but when I just play not recording, this is who I use, um, he's not a picky eater, so he can eat spoiled foods, he is charged by lightning, like it makes him run really fast, and you can upgrade him with gears, which is really awesome, but he's damaged by water. Wickerbottom. She's very sensitive to uh, spoiled food, unlike WX. Um, she knows many things, so I guess that means more recipes, and she can't sleep, which is... I'll get into that later, maybe. And then we're back to Wilson. So, we're gonna select Wilson, because he's just your average character, just... Yeah. Alright, so this is what happens, this is what it looks like when you spawn in the game. You move around with WASD, and... What you want to do right at the beginning is just go up to the things like saplings and grass. You can't get the trees yet. I'll get into that after. And uh, just pick them. Just hold left click. Just click left click on them. This is a carrot. You should, you should get some food. Um, this is called flint. You need it for tools like axes, pickaxes. So we can make an axe and cut down the trees, which is very important. That's a bee's nest. Stay away from those in the beginning. They kill you if you, like, attack them. Yeah, just leave them be. Leave them be. Don't worry about them. So that's what you want to do on your first date, is just gather supplies. Just gather, 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 gather. That's all you want to really be doing. So, pick a few flowers, it's good, so let's go over these. So this is the day one, we're on day one. This is the world, like, meter. The yellow is daytime, the red is dusk, like when it's going to be nighttime soon. Um, and the black is nighttime, when it gets very dark. So you want to have, a, what you call it? You want to have light sources by then, which is very important. You need light sources. That's your health. You can get damaged. Pretty simple. That's your health. You can regen regenerate your health by eating cooked foods. And that's a turkey. That's really... I was not expecting that. He goes around through berry bushes and stuff, so... Yeah. That was not expecting that. Get out of there, boy. Okay, I guess he doesn't want to come out. So I'm just picking some berries, because those are good food. Um... Yeah, so, and then the brain is your sanity, that's what I was talking about, sleep is good for your sanity, I think spawning Abigail, if you're using the ghost, is bad for your sanity, but Wickerbottom can't sleep, the librarian, so that's not good. Oh, wow, what do we have here? Sometimes there's these structures, so we could get some rocks, which are good for, like, making refined products later. Don't worry about it too much, rocks are good, not that important in the beginning, but if you can pick them up, well, why not? So, and then this is where you can craft things. You can make more things once you get a science machine, which we'll get into later. But for now, you just want to craft the basic tools, like an axe and a pickaxe. So I can get these rocks, but more importantly, I really need to get some trees. So I can build a campfire by nighttime, so when night comes, I don't die. So yeah, as you can see, the durability on the right-hand side, my axe is going down as I pick up these logs. It's very good. You definitely need them. So, as you can see, this is how you like make all the things. That's a campfire. I've got enough. But you have to add fuel to the campfire. Otherwise, it'll just burn out eventually. Unless you've got really good fuel, which you probably don't. We don't have super good fuel. You're just going to use logs, which is fine. It's good fuel, but you, you need some logs. You can't just start a campfire and not expect to have to use anymore. But we found a cemetery. And sometimes those things like drop gold. But I think I just saw like... I, don't, I thought I saw something that way. Flint is very important. That's a spider. We're going to stay away from them because they're very hostile. Do not go near spiders on your first day. Do not, oh, is that gold? Oh, sweet. Gold. Yeah, gold is very useful. You can make a science machine with gold. But you can't, I don't think you can transport them, so we're not going to do that right now. We're just going to gather... Actually, I think I'm just going to set up my base right here. I'm going to pick up this... Oh, that's a spider. Ugh. 
Spiders are dangerous. They drop good things, but they're very dangerous. Die. Chop, 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 chop. Ow, he hurts, but I got him. Okay, he didn't really drop anything good. But we got monster meat, so don't eat this, okay? Do not eat it. I think it's bad for you. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. You can change your camera view by pressing E. I need campfire. No. Whew, guys, I barely made it. Because see, when it's nighttime, you can't build a campfire because you can't see. So I barely did that in time. So you don't want to do that, guys. Let's cook it. I think you have to cook it, and that's okay. Okay, that was bad for my insanity. And, yeah. Okay, don't eat monster meat, guys. I just learned that. I wasn't sure if you could eat that, but I or don't eat it. Alright. We can cook all our berries. What this does is it makes them last longer so they don't go spoiled as easily. Which is definitely a good thing. So yeah, we're just waiting for a night to go by. Usually you want to be able to do something. Like I could normally chop these things, but I don't want to go too far out. And we need to add some fuel. Left click to add fuel. There we go. Let's add some pine cones. There. Alright. Good. Okay. So, we got that gold, which we weren't even really really expecting to find but it's good to have we need more grass we do not have a lot of grass so i'm just going to show you guys what you can make before you get a science machine you can make a torch which is only in case you can't get flint and get wood it's only if you can't do that because torches don't provide as much light and can are just not as good you can't hold anything or do anything so yeah all right uh, then there's science, so at the science machine, not gonna get into that right away. You make a grass suit, which is armor, and you can make a garland, which is, like, good for your insanity, I think. Keeps you calm a little bit. Okay, so we need to go, we might as well go pick some food. Wow, there's so many saplings here. Very good. Very good. And we can just leave our campfire, we don't have to worry about it. Definitely cut down some more trees. We need to do that. Um, go. So much grass. That's what we need more. But saplings are always good time. You just want to keep gathering. That that like weird thing. That's a spider egg spawn thing. It spawns those spiders that we do not want to mess with right now. So yeah, peace out. Um, this is a road. You can run faster on a road, which is pretty nice. But I don't know what that stuff is. Those marks on the ground. That's weird. Uh, yeah. Okay. Goodbye. Uh, let's cut down this tree. I want to go back and get those rocks, because rocks are very good. You need rocks. And also, there's sometimes rocks that have gold in them, which are very, very useful. You need gold pretty badly in this. We already have one, so we can make a science machine. But you can use uh, gold and rocks for many other things. So, Oh, looks like something died over here. Okay, we're in a swamp. This, is a, this purple area is a swamp, I think. Oh, that's a gold rock. That's what the gold rocks look like, guys. So, you right-click to equip your pickaxe, mine it, you should get at least one piece of gold, maybe even two. And I think I see a grass suit in that top right. Yeah, we got two, that was lucky, you almost always just get one. So, that was pretty lucky. Pretty lucky indeed. So, let's just see, if, okay, that just ends. So, I think, yeah, it just ends, I don't know why that is. Um, let's get these rocks, and yeah, there's a bunch of twigs on the ground and a grass suit. I don't really get that, but I'll take the free twigs any day. And a nice bit of flint, and I'll put it on the grass suit. It's kind of damaged. What would you expect from someone thinking who's that something that's dead? Alright, oh wow, there's more rocks. Okay, these drop these things drop niter, which is not very useful. I think you can use it to make explosives or something. We're just gonna leave it, because we really don't want it. Drop. We, uh, honestly, I don't even want it right now. Just want these rocks. The flint's good, too. Don't desperately need the flint. But, yeah. We could use more grass. We don't have that much. Yeah, basically, the first few days, really all you want to do is, um... Make sure you have enough food, gather food and supplies. And try and find an area that you think would be good for a base. I'm basically going to tell you some of the good characteristics of a base. So what you want to be able to have is easy access to these animals called beefalo that hopefully we'll find because they drop manure, which you think, oh, manure is disgusting. Maybe in real life, yes, but in this game it is very essential to growing crops and many other things. It's, it's, you can fertilize things and everything. It's really important. I think we just saw... 
Yeah, just leave those people alone. Just leave them alone. Don't even worry about them. I don't really know exactly what those are. I don't know all of the animals and mobs in this game. I think they're like only, I think you can steal their eggs and cook them or something. But we don't have to do that because we are nice people. We don't need their eggs. We have our own food. And I think someone's going to message me on Skype soon. I, I sense it. So if a Skype message go off, it's probably not you. So don't worry. There's so many gold rocks here. We definitely could use the gold. It's very, very good to have. So we're just going to get all the gold. We might have to make a new pickaxe. Oh, for sure. That's fine. We have all the flints in the worlds and the twigs. That's fine. We need this gold because gold is so valuable. You can make better tools. That's not even what for. You can make so many things with gold. It's just prime. Don't worry. I'll get those rocks. Oh, crap. Getting late. Well, we still have a bit of time before it's actually night. Right now it's just dusk. So, yeah, not a big deal. Um, yeah. Whew, okay. Another thing for a good base, you want to have easy access to grass and twigs. I know, like, when you break them, they do grow back eventually, but you can make your own little grass twig thing farm, but you need manure for that, so. And you need to at least tie, dig, you need to dig them up, and we can make shovels later once we build the science machine. Which we're not gonna do yet because I'm not gonna be able to mine it back up, I don't think. <sighs> and I don't feel like wasting gold and wood. Mine it. Mine it. So many gold rocks, this is insane. It's awesome. So much gold. And rocks. <laughs> yeah, things only stack up to 40. I think gold only stacks to 20, but most things stack up somewhere between 20 and 40. I think so. And my pick broke again built rocks and lots of flint it's a flint too all right just so many gold rocks this is actually insane holy crap this is awesome though the go more gold so much gold so this is if you find this you're very lucky if you're not if you don't don't worry about it you can go on an expedition one day find some gold rocks you should try and at least find one so you can make your science machine but if you can't, that's definitely priorities to get at least one gold rock. So you can get one gold to make that science machine. Because you need a science machine in your base. It's just so important. You don't even know if you don't know that. Either way, let's go. Mine, mine, mine. Gold nugget, pick up rocks, and flint. There's just so many gold rocks. This is actually insane. Okay, once I mine this one, I'm going to make my campfire. I don't want to... I don't want to risk it too late like I did last time. Boom. Boom. Once I get two stacks of 40 rocks, there's no point. Um, I'll put it right there so I can do... So I can mine up a few more gold rocks. Boom, boom, boom. New pickaxe! We've gone through so many pickaxes, but it's totally worth it. 100%. Gold, gold, rocks, rocks, flint, rocks flint oh crap we need more fuel add fuel add fuel good flint rocks let's cook up these oh i got i need to eat these berries before they spoil i'll keep that one i guess eating petals is good for your health i know we're at full but the, the only thing that's good about getting them is mining them it's good for your insanity just picking them up Cook, cook, cook. There we go. Yeah, we need to go pick some flowers, too. Because this can't be good for your insanity. Yeah, guys, see how much gold we have? But we've got a lot. We can always come back here. It's marked on our map. If you press M, it shows the map. So we can always come back to this rock biome. So, I think what we're going to... Oh, gosh. Is this world really that big? I was just scrolling. And that's a good size. All right. Um, I think we can make it through the night. Let's cook some seeds, though. Let's just eat these berries. I really don't want them to spoil. So, yeah. We're good. And daytime. Any second now. Any second now. Any second now. Any second now. Come on. Yay. Daytime. 
All right, let's just mine this last gold rock. I know I just went another one up. There's there's rocks everywhere. All right, I'm just so tempted to mine them because the gold's so so tempting. We need it so badly. All right. Okay, I think we should just keep exploring this way because I feel like it. That's why. All right, we do not need to really pick up these rocks. Not really. Oh, okay, I guess I'm, that was like a weird shadow that I just saw. Must be going insane. I need to pick some flowers. Need to pick some flowers, gonna make a new pick real quick. I'm gonna equip the axe though. Thanks for the seeds, birds. Thank you very much. Alright, we're not gonna mine up any more rocks. We need to find flowers. Flowers. We need to find flowers and grass really badly. Oh wow, we have a lot of flint. Holy crap. Hmm. Okay, there's a beehive. Okay. Alright, any grass, so yes. Flowers would be awesome too because they help with your insanity. Just picking them. I mean, I'm not going that insane, but no, it would be nice to bring it up a little bit. You know, even if you can make a garland with the flowers too. I really shouldn't have eaten those. You can like it's good for your nerves apparently. So yeah. And pick up one more rock, why not? Get this last tree. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. Okay. Let's keep exploring. Okay. Let's get all this stuff. Oh, really? I do not want. I'm not like, taking up an extra space with one rock. No thanks. I already have 80 rocks. I'm good. Okay, so we need to go back and t this way. So this is the way that we really haven't been that much. If it goes nowhere, we're just gonna head back and try and find a new biome. Hey, berry bushes, that's a good sign of life. Let's eat them. Just quick, quickly give them a quick nibble. So much flint. We can make a chest later to store some stuff. Good idea. Okay, where the where the grass at? Where did I grass set? Alright, so this just ends too. Awesome. Thanks. Alright. We need to find beefaloes, which are... Okay, that's a wormhole. That's not good for insanity. If you go through it, it's like a teleport. It basically, it's... I don't know, is it like a different world, kind of? It's not different, but it's like a newly different worlds like it's the same biomes and stuff it's not like in minecraft going to the nether i don't know maybe it is i can't remember um yeah okay well where are the flowers oh that's a bunny hey yeah bunnies are important because you can set traps you can't catch them they're too fast but if you set traps that's good Okay, those those are like if you attack them they're bad. I'm just gonna stay away from that. Those bishops, yeah, just don't just leave them alone. All right, let's eat some seeds. Need grass. I have enough for a campfire. I just mm, I don't like how little grass I have. All right, we're gonna head this way back through the cemetery. So yeah, cause you run faster on roads. So it's good. It's definitely good. Definitely. Oh, flower. Yes, this is a flower biome. Yay. Okay, yeah, this is where I set camp. With the weird fog and stuff. Yeah, we need to go south. Alright, cool. Found two flowers. It was good for insanity. Oh, carrots. Okay, we have a full inventory now, so that's not exactly good. Let's eat that carrot. 
We need to find grass though. Grass is very important. You want to make sure that you're always stockpiled on it. And we found some. Good, good, good. Let's just harvest up. Oh, jeez, turkeys. Oh, look, watch this. Here, turkey, turkey, turkey. Dang it. He ran into a new berry bush. Because I know that you can bait them and then quickly kill them. Get some, like, drumsticks. Oh, well. If he comes back out, I know what to do. All right, we're going to save these and make up a, make a garland. Yeah, our sanity's not full, so, yeah. It's cool, it's cool. Yes, getting all this grass. Alright, we don't need, you don't need beefaloes. You don't, you, you can rely on different sources of food. But I definitely like to camp near them, because they're good. You really need that manure. So, yeah, I think I'm going to... Can't carry any more stuff, right? Just eat it, boy. Just eat the carrot. Yay, flower. Okay. <gasps> yes, this is the biome where the beefaloes spawn. This, like, grasslands. Maybe there's gonna be some beefaloes. Oh. Crap. You never wanna forget to light a campfire. Just made it there, guys. Just made it. Pick up that flower. Let's go back to our campfire. Alright, let's add some pine cones. So I want to get more inventory slots opened up. The reason is because I have lots of rocks, flint, and gold. They're each, just together. They're taking up six slots in my inventory. So yeah, it's kind of not the greatest. Let's toast up some seeds. Very nice, very nice. Just gotta wait for till night's over. Um, anything else I can do? Hmm. Yeah, I really don't need to do that. I think I'm gonna unequip. Might as well keep it on. But I won't, once I get a science machine, get to make some chests. Which I need a lot more wood then. But I just want to find some bee flows. If I find bee flows, I'm setting up camp. I'm going to get some wood. And if we find those bee flows, we're going to set up a quick camp. Show you the basics of setting up camp if you do find the necessities that I've found. And uh, then we're going to call it an episode, I think. So, yeah. If you guys are finding this tutorial helpful or you like watching it, uh, please let me know down in the comments. It would I would really appreciate it if you guys left some support. That would be awesome. Let me know that you enjoy these. And, yeah. So that's a like one for more in the future. If, yeah, if you do enjoy. Okay. But it's almost morning, so let's get on with this stuff. Come on, come on, come on. And yellow. Right about now. It's day three. Do you mind? Thank you. Let's go find those beefaloes. I know they're around here. Okay, good. We have rabbits. Those are definitely good. We have at least one. One rabbit hole. Okay, we have rabbits. No, I don't want this biome to end. No, I need beefaloes. No! Where are you, beefaloes? I know you're in here somewhere. Alright, so... Yeah... Let's go get those beefaloes. Huh. Huh. I know they're in here somewhere. They're just hiding from me. Yeah, you can't catch the rabbits. Don't even try. That's why I'm not even trying to kill. Okay, so that's good. There's a bunch of rabbits. Does that show up on the map? Not really, but I can remember. There's a lot of grass, too. It's pretty nice. But no beefaloes. <clears throat> beefaloes, come on. I am waiting. What's that? It's just a glitch, I guess. Darker part of the road. No! No, I do not want to do this. I must find the beefalo. I must find the beefalo. Okay, not that way. Oh, there's flowers, though. Flowers. I think you need 12, so... Yay! There we go. Yay! Now our insanity is going up, up, up. All right. So if we go, we can explore this area and then go explore this area around here. So let's go. Let's follow the road. We need to go south a bit. Hey there, bunny, 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 bunny. All right. Let's, let's see where we are. Yeah. Just want to explore this side. 
um, the carrot, the seeds, and a berry. Okay. I only have two berries left, so we can use a bit more food. Here's a berry bush. That's an evil mushroom, I think. Or no, it's just a red one. But we don't need mushrooms anymore. So, yay. Whew. Okay. Hmm. If we don't find beefaloes, we're just gonna have to end the episode and set up base next time. Because we need the beefalo. They don't like me. Beefaloes don't like to exist. This is sign of beefalo. Manure. Watch. We found the beefaloes, guys. We got them. Yay. And there's rabbits right here. Yes. Yes. You don't want to set your ba beefalo at your base right beside them. Don't do that. Oh. Okay. I don't know what I just found. Backpack. Yay. Oh, right. I don't need to remove my thing. I've got a backpack. Some ropes. I don't want that. Some more rope. Those are very useful. Okay. Pick up this manure. Uh, there's only one beefalo, it looks like. That's what beefaloes look like, if you didn't know. Yeah. Hmm. <clears throat> well, it's better than none. And hopefully more will come along. So we're gonna set up base right here. Yeah, right here sounds like a good place. Oh, crap. Need to do that. Okay. Crap. Which way I was... Uh, is this the right way? I think so. Yeah, okay. Um, go down a little bit. Yeah, right here is good. Okay, so first thing, science machine. Right there. Now we can make so many more things. Next thing, we need wood, which we do not have a lot of. But yeah, we should also make this a permanent fire pit. Is that good? Maybe we should have done that later, because now I desperately need wood. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Alright, then... Okay, how are we gonna survive the night? Maybe use some manure as fuel. Maybe. But, I'll figure it out, guys. I think you guys should be good. Oh, we can sleep. Sleep. Yay. Alright, so thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you did all enjoy. See you guys all next time. Have a great day. Bye for now.